came to us and, and uh, said, you know, I'm launching an innovative uh, retail shopping experience. And obviously we know Melissa, we're in the neighborhood in the King West and we've shopped at her store. Melissa's well known in, in, the, in the business world and in the industry. Uh, we talked about some different ideas and that's how the Naked Campaign came to be. Our client, Got Style, uh, is just starting a, a new form of shopping on Skype, which is pretty new in the marketplace, but the technology works. And, and uh, this was a great opportunity to sort of take that idea and turn it into something uh, creative and, and uh, in terms of promotion and marketing, um, should be brilliant. So we wanted to launch Skype shopping. We wanted to do something really special. So I thought the partnership of us two would make sure that we really hit something out of the ballpark. She's very much about, uh, obviously, men's clothes and style, but also about innovation. And we wanted to help her with that, with some innovative ideas and uh, an in innovative uh, commercial that features a naked man. Are we okay to have a naked guy on the spot? We need a naked guy. Yeah, doesn't he have to be naked? Yeah. Yeah, he's, he's naked. naked. He's oh. gotta be naked. Oh, yummy. I definitely think if you want to engage a customer, it can't just be one aspect. So we're doing the commercial, we're going to relaunch our mobile app, and hopefully we're going to throw in a game as well too. And really the whole Naked Man thing is a huge campaign integrated across all mediums. That's really the, the new world that we're in today. It's like a fun and cheeky way of, of, of playing with the idea that that um, guys are really busy, guys really need clothes fast sometimes. Everybody wants to be part of something interesting, integrated, uh, big, and it doesn't feel like an ad. It's not trying to sell people, but it's more or less entertaining them and giving them some value. Oh yeah, like, well, I used to live in an apartment, so that was like every day. I've never personally uh, found myself naked on a balcony uh, outside someone's apartment. In 1979, I went streaking. Did the classic last day of school, ran through the uh, cafeteria in, in our uh, naked man suit. So, uh, been there, done that. Every man should have a good blazer in this closet because it can take you from a casual outfit into an evening outfit. I love a beautiful jacket. I like cardigans. I like cardigans a lot. I usually like to wear them. I feel a little more comfortable in it sometimes. Um, yeah, watches have always been a big deal for me, so I think I have a nice one. For me, uh, shoes. I'm all about the shoes. Like, you've got to have good shoes. You know why? Because women look at shoes first. I have probably about 25 pairs of jeans, maybe more. My signature piece actually is a pair of jeans, and um, uh, I wear it probably 295 days a year. Um, the whole secret is people don't tend to notice the same pair of jeans. Uh, it was fun to actually, it's fun to work with actors. Uh, we haven't been arrested yet, which we're very uh, excited about. And a naked dude is always, it's always fun to get a naked dude out on a balcony, <laughs> see how people react. 